Hi there! In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to make this industrial looking light pendant with Dollar Tree supplies. If you saw my DIY foam board, barn door headboard, you saw the handcuffs from the Halloween section that I purchased at Dollar Tree. I mentioned in that tutorial to hang on to the chain. Well, this is what I came up with. I will include all materials needed and where I got them down below in the description. The first thing I did was disassemble the sink drain and set it on top of the basket to see where I would want to place it. Then using black floral wire, I threaded it through the center of the basket. I pulled tight and twisted. I then threaded the wire up into the center of the metal part of the drain with the drain facing down and then into the center of the rubber part of the drain. Then I went ahead and attached the plastic chain by wrapping the wire around it and pulled the wire back down through the holes into the basket where I then tightly twisted and trimmed the extra wire. Then I did the same process as with the basket at the other end of the chain. I wrapped the floral wire around it twice and then threaded it into my drain in the rubber stopper. However, instead of going through the center hole of the metal sink drain, I threaded the wire up into the outside hole so this way the wire would not slip through. I left the wire long in case I needed it to attach to my ceiling later. Once I tied the wire tight, I was ready to paint. I used black Krylon chalkboard spray paint that I purchased at Hobby Lobby. While your pendant is drying outside, go ahead and open up the batteries and make sure all of your lights work. These are from the Dollar Tree. I purchased three of them because they fit nicely inside the basket. Now instead of painting my push lights, I decided to make it easy and less messy by using black electrical tape from the Dollar Tree. And I simply just cut it and wrapped it around and I was happy with the way that looked. Now our last thing to do is attach our push lights. I went ahead and peeled the backing off of it and they did stick okay, but I wanted to secure it even more so by hot gluing them into place. Now the three of them just fit in perfect. Peel the back and get your hot glue gun out and secure it from the other side. While you hot glue them, hold them in place for a little bit because the glue melts the sticky part and they did start slipping. But if I just held them there until that glue dried fully, they stayed put. Okay. 
All right, that's all there is to it. I hope you enjoyed the simple DIY and that you make one yourself. And if you do, please tag me over on Instagram at Coffee Crafts and Chaos so I can see. Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe to my channel so I can share my latest DIYs with you. Have a wonderful day.